how to fix Foxfly or Wi-Fi hotspot tethering not being able to connect to devices after installing NetGuard Firewall app on your Android device. Okay, hello and welcome to this short and simple video about how to fix your Foxfy Wi-Fi hotspot connection after you have installed NetGuard Firewall app on your Android device and you are no longer able to connect to your Foxfy Wi-Fi hotspot. Uh, but first, I want to draw your attention to the center of the screen here where you'll notice this gray orb going in a circular motion. That is where my finger is touching the screen and I wanted to clarify that for you so it will be easier for you to follow along throughout the rest of the video. So you probably had FoxFi installed on your device before you installed NetGuard and your FoxFi was probably working just fine and you were able to go to the internet and you were able to go to apps like YouTube and you were able to access your internet apps just fine without any problems uh, such as I'm doing here in the example here however after you installed NetGuard you found out that you were no longer able to connect to your Foxfy and I'm going to show you how that you're going to be able to fix that very quickly and very simply as you could see earlier I've got my Foxfy hotspot up and running as you can see right here it is running but when we go over here to my Ubuntu I'm getting this connection failed activation of network connection failed message and you can see that it says over here Wi-Fi not connected and when I go to select a network, I choose the Foxfy network, and I click on connect, and when I go back up here to connect to it, it just keeps on saying Wi-Fi connecting, Wi-Fi connecting, but it, it never connects. And it'll just stay there and it'll keep saying Wi-Fi connecting and it'll keep going until that message pops back up that says connection failed. And I can leave it here for a minute until that message pops back up. It'll come up. It'll come up here in just a moment. But you get the point. You can see that oh there it is right there. It just popped up. Connection failed. And you can see that whenever I try to click on a wet on a link on a web page I have no internet so what I'm gonna do is take you back over here to the Android screen and I'm gonna show you a quick and easy way to fix this problem so you go into your NetGuard settings and those are located in your upper right hand corner there's three little dots and a vertical line that you can see right here where it says more options. You'll click on that and then right here you'll click on settings and then right here you'll click on network options. And what we want to activate is this one right here that says allow tethering. But we're unable to do that right now. You see it's grayed out. Before you can activate that one, you have to activate this one up here that says subnet routing. So you activate that one. Now we can activate allow tethering. So you activate allow tethering. And then when we go back over to our screen, we can see that the Wi-Fi is now connected. I should be able to click on that link now 
and it should go. There we go. And if I want to click on another link, like uh, let's try let others browse Chrome as a guest. And here we go, browse Chrome as a guest. So that's the quick and easy fix. And um, it should work for any other tethering issues that you have. It should work for USB tethering. It should work for just simple hotspot issues. If you're unable to connect with your hotspot, this fix should work for you. Um, I know for a fact it works for uh, FoxSpy and Ubuntu, but it should work just as easily for Windows. Um, I, I'm not offering any guarantees. I haven't tested this with any other, uh, with, with just regular hotspot. I haven't tested it with uh, any other operating systems. I've only tested it with FoxSpy and, <clears throat> and Ubuntu. But I'm betting that those settings will help you if you have Windows, and I'm betting that those settings will help you to connect if you have uh, just a regular hotspot and you're not able connect, to connect and you want to use NetGuard because NetGuard is a good firewall. Listen, if this video uh, helped you out in any kind of way, then go ahead and give me a like. And um, if you want to uh, get updates to uh, any new videos that I have coming out then subscribe to my channel so that you can get updates and uh, thank you very much for watching this video